Welcome back to another episode of Stellaris. I am Rosakius. Thank you for joining me. We are in a bit of a conundrum. Uh, shortly after I ended the last episode, Dar decided to give me another shot at attacking me again. And to make it better, these guys came at me too. And so, I'm, I'm not doing well right now. This is the basic story. Um, I'm gonna leave two nine here. Where's my construction? We're gonna move him back this way. We're gonna have him build the mining stations there. Actually, no. Let's continue this. We have one of, so we're gonna have one of these guys stay, and one of them go back ooh, to attack these guys. And he's got, he's added a fair amount to his um, repertoire. Actually, I'm gonna send them both back because, yeah, he has a lot more than he used to. So that's not looking good for us. I do have this starting to build a... another fleet. I think we're gonna have to change this to a shipyard though to make it go faster. This is the big one that we're concerned with. I'm okay with letting those sit for now. We need to g take care of them and uh, make sure that they just can't keep going at us right now. That's that's our, our base concern right now is that they come in and take everything before I have a chance to really get my feet on the ground. So I'm trying to get my feet on the ground basically. Aren't you supposed to, like, be able to shoot? Why do you have naval logistics? Oh, that's to increase my naval capacities. So, yeah, it, the problem that I'm seeing here is that he's actually seeming to team up both of these groups together. So it isn't just um, that I have to deal with them both. They're all going to be in one cluster. So that's going to be a problem, to say it lightly. I'm going to send them back there. Construction complete. And I'm going to send you back there. Whoa, whoa, nope. What the heck was that? I'm used to, um, I've been playing a little bit of Europa Universalis on the side, and I'm kind of used to the highlighting everything before I take it method. I think a key is these construction guys have to kind of continue what they were doing. We don't have a ton of spare minerals right now, but we do have a fair amount growing. Uh, do we have anything that we can build here? Sure, that'll work. Enemy presence exposed. You two together. 
and uh, we're gonna recruit a new admiral. Technology secure. And I guess we're gonna go with weapons range for this one. Do we have, how close, 23 seconds until we start double producing. That will help speed up the creation of this new fleet quite a bit. Where are they all going? Oh, they're all coming to me. Construction complete. All right. Upgrade the defenses. We have... Um... Let's go with fusion missiles since they're going to be quick. Construction complete. And it looks like we're almost here so I'm gonna move him forward a little bit more construction complete Nice, now we have two building. This is upgrading just to make sure if he comes and gets me. And it looks like he's actually gonna come down here. So what we're gonna do, gonna build some defenses just to see if we can't narrow them down a little bit more. And then we did three of each. So let's do one, two, three more destroyers. One, two, three more Corvettes. Pray. Now it looks like, what are you doing? Are you actually coming over? Yes, you are, okay. But it looks like he's actually coming at Cavs... Cavs... Whatever this is. Um, we'll upgrade. And put on a gun battery. How, how big is this? 1.5. We're getting there. We're getting there. We're gonna choose not to build research, so we're, I guess we're that was a stupid move. Vessels upgraded. I was kind of hoping by increasing the range of this thing that it would actually start to shoot them down when they try to skirt around like that. But that does not seem to be the case. 2.2, he's at 2.6. I'm gonna move this guy back further. I feel like the, what they're going for here is they want to sweep through and get as much as they possibly can and then try to piece out. Uh, I am still 
beating their little butts. So, so far, that's not been a... We're gonna go and try to kill these. Do I want to do disruptors or let's do boosters? Um, I don't know what I want to do here. My concern is if I send, well, that's a 200, I guess. So we should send after this one, and then this guy can go this way. How are we doing? 2.6. Shipyard, how are you doing? One, two, three. Just Corvettes, but we'll take them. He's at 2.7 now. I think what I'm going to do here... Policies and edicts. Oh, I don't have the one to, for minerals. I was going to throw that up. Enemy presence exposed. Let's upgrade this. So he put both of his fleets in one spot. At least for now. Actually, these are two different fleets from two different governments. And it looks like they're heading up towards this. Which means he is coming to Vilth. Which could actually work in our favor. Vilth has guns on it. Um, let's do this. So if I can force him Vessels upgraded. to come out to Vilth, I'll have some backup there. Another seven, another eighteen hundred. How the hell is that a thing? Is that twenty nine thirty? I might actually skip out on this. How is he putting together fleets so quickly? How 
far back is this guy? He's pretty far back. I'm gonna leave this one here. Um, let's unlock the Star Fortress. That's gonna take a little bit longer, but I'm not upgrading anymore anyway, so that's fine. How f how how much are you? Sixty-eight. Um. Let's see. Well, at least they're not taking this thing anytime soon. But what I think I think I can actually take this. So I'll take these 2.7 out. And the other fleet is so far behind that it that I should hopefully be able to finish up before he gets there and then I can fly away, hopefully. That's the idea. All right, charging swarm, go charge. It's 3.8, it's actually my biggest fleet now. <laughs> All right, here we go. Oops, wrong combat. So I have the numbers advantage. I don't know, and I also have cruisers, and he does not. So that might actually help me quite a bit here. It's at 1.8, 1.7. Let's take a look at this guy. He is close too close um, I kind of want to see if I can skirt all right um, we are going to fly away construction And hope to God he can make it. Uh, 2.9. He's not actually bad. But I would like to have him heal up just a little bit, um, if possible. Oh, he's actually turning around, so he's going to be walking in straight into this guy. I doubt he probably even realizes it. Let's have this guy turn around too. Oh. Okay. We'll have him turn all the way around. <laughs> Construction complete. He also doesn't have cruisers, so that's a technology that I have that um, neither of these two has, so that could be a huge advantage for me. Send him that way. 
3.5 versus 3.2 again. This, that one's closer than the other one was. I feel like he must have gotten some reinforcement somewhere along the way or something. Point two. So here's the thing. We not only have to kill all of their fleets, we have to take back all of our stuff, and I really want to take some of their stuff in the process. I want to make this... I want to make them hurt for having done this to me. So hopefully we can do that. New research, improved boosters. Um, we're gonna go for advanced combat rolls. I think we got this in the bag. How about this fight? How's this one going? Oh, psh. He only has 1,000. This guy's toast. This one is an actual fight. Ooh. Not looking great. I mean, we're kicking him, but he's sticking around. I'm not sure if that's either good for us or bad for us. This is a long ass battle, man. Let's check where this guy's at. Wow, this one already finished that up. We're gonna have him go in that way. And we're gonna have this guy go back and heal, basically. Actually, I'm gonna have him go back and update because upgrading will actually heal him in the process, so we'll get a double bonus there. Um, 279, we have that, so we're gonna go ahead and do that too. And that's going to be it for this episode. Thanks for joining me. Make sure to like and subscribe, and we'll see you again next time. Bye-bye.